Hey everyone, in this video we will learn how to find uh, the range for a numerical feature using Python. So let's say you've got a data set and you want to find the range for let's say certain column. And how do you do that in Python? We'll, we'll learn that here. So I've got this um, Jupyter Notebook open here with me. I'll also upload this file to GitHub. And I'll leave a link to the file as well as the data set I'm using in the video notes so you can download the file and do the tutorial along with me. The only thing you might need to change or you will need to change is this location wherever you're saving test.csv on your machine just pointed there. So let's start. So the first one I'm doing is importing pandas as pd and then I'm just pointing uh, the data frame to uh, the file location. I'm using pd.readcsv and I'm just giving the file location name. So I hit shift enter. That's what you do in Jupyter Notebooks to execute a cell. So that's happened. Now, if I want to see my data frame, I, I'm just doing a df.hit, which will give me the first 10 rows. So you can liken it to select top 10 star if you're from the SQL Server world. So I hit shift enter and you can see it's giving me the top 10 rows here. So it says it's got passenger ID, passenger class, gender, age, so on and so forth. So let's say um, I want to find the uh, the range for age. All I need to do is so it's, this is an Excel. Let me come over here. All I'm saying is df dot age max minus df dot age min. So df dot age max will give me the maximum value for age, uh, and uh, df dot age dot min will give me the minimum value for age for that particular column. So let's just do a shift enter, and you can see it's giving me the range. Now, for example, uh, let's see if there's anything else we could just probably. PC class. So if I were to use PC class, it would probably not make sense, but let's just do that. P, what's it called? P class. And I'm going to execute this. And you can say it's just giving me a range of two because probably all, uh, all the uh, passenger classes, first class, second class, and third class. So that makes sense in this particular case. So in this video, we learned how to find the range uh, for a numerical feature uh, using Python. We have specifically used pandas uh, in this uh, video. I hope you find this video useful and thanks for watching this video. Please do subscribe to my uh, channel if you enjoy what I'm doing and please do like this video if it works for you. Cheers, bye.